Acumatica will allow for additional checks and balances through a multi-step approval process. For the purpose of this demonstration, we're going to look at the purchase order process. You've indicated as a company that any orders that are over $5,000, you would like to have reviewed to make sure that they've been approved. So we've signed on as Regina Wiley, who is our purchasing clerk. As an AP clerk, her dashboard and her workspaces are going to be different than someone who is the controller. She's only going to have access to what she can do. So Regina is going to go ahead and she's going to start a new purchase order for us. And today we're going to be purchasing uh, from our go-to vendor. And it pulls up that vendor information. And then we're going to purchase an injection molding machine. And it looks like I didn't select my vendor correctly. So using my type ahead feature, I need to double click on that to make it stay. So again, in our document details, we're looking for an injection molding machine. And we want to purchase one of those. We're going to go ahead and save this. And you'll notice that it saves on a hold status. Uncheck the hold, and it will now change the order to pending approval. The reason it's changed to pending approval is that we have decided that any item over $5,000 will need approval before it can be processed. Once Regina finishes the order, it's now going to go to our purchasing manager for him to review. Michael Andrews is our manager. You will notice again, his dashboard is a little bit different than Regina's. Michael will go to purchases. He clicks on purchase orders. You will see that there's now a purchase order that's pending approval for this item. Michael will simply drill down onto this purchase order to see the details. Regina could have left notes for him if she needed to. And Michael's going to review this. And once he approves it, he can go ahead and approve it. Once the purchase order has been approved, Michael will email that purchase order to the vendor. This allows the vendor to directly process our request. And we also have an attachment showing that we've sent that email to the vendor requesting our purchase.